Let's take a look. Ooh. Oh, let's just get out of there. Okay. Um, my favorite <laughs> <laughs> and welcome to today's video. So as you can tell by the title of this video, I'm going to be mixing every single beauty YouTuber's eyeshadow palettes together to create the ultimate eyeshadow color. <laughs> Now, this is actually not a brand new revolutionary idea. Sifia and Nygaard actually did this about two years ago, but since then, there has been so many more palettes that have come out. It seems like everyone and their mother has a makeup brand now. So, we are going to be mixing all of these gorgeous shadows from the past year. I'm also going to be doing a huge giveaway of these palettes at the end of this video. So if you wanna find out how to win these gorgeous palettes, stick around to the end to find out how to win. All right, so we are going to start off with Jeffree Star's Blood Lust Palette. Now, I feel like out of all of them, this is like the newest one to the party. So I figured we'd start with this one. Now, going back to Sophia's video, oh wow, this is gorgeous. Her results look like this. I feel like this is probably gonna look similar, but I am curious with crazy shades that Jeffrey comes out with, if that's gonna change anything. I really don't know much about makeup, so all my opinions that you're gonna hear through this video are coming from someone who literally doesn't know anything about the makeup world. I'm just a person who likes colors. So, with that said, let's get started. Okay, so the process is pretty much gonna be just me Scrapey day being a layer off of the eyeshadow so it can be used for the giveaway later. Oh my god, I'm scared. I don't want to do this. It feels like I shouldn't do this. But at the same time, I kind of want to do it like really bad. Okay. Ah. Oh, this is going to be difficult. <laughs> is that enough? I feel like that was not enough. I feel like one of the issues that we're gonna have is how do we make it so they're all even? I'm already over this. Like, <laughs> one shade, <laughs> one shade. I'm so tired. I feel like I should just do them all. Straight and then brush it. Yeah. Yeah, I agree, I agree. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Joey, you're doing a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean to. <laughs> uh, oh, oh no. <laughs> People love the little stamps and you're just erasing <laughs> <laughs> There's no way to go around it. I can't keep the stamp if I want. Oh my god. Oh, this one's harder to oh. dig in. Joey, that's a lie. No, it's fine. Just one scrape. You're doing too many scrapes. No, I'm not. <laughs> we need to get some pigmentation. I apologize to everyone who was excited for this giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> you really did that one. I know, but I want. I like it a lot. <laughs> okay. I don't know how I'm gonna get this all in and out <laughs> once. I don't, I kind of didn't think that far. I'm just gonna scoop it all to one end. So I'm just gonna like guide them all together. It's gonna be a very dirty palette for whoever receives it, but you know what? Joey! <laughs> oh no. Joey. Oh no. No, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're gonna have to buy a new one for the giveaway. What happened? I don't know. <laughs> Should I tweet at Jeffrey? Cause you know how like some of those people will tweet like, oh my God, my <laughs> daughter got into this makeup. Should I say that? Can you send me a new one? Or multiple personalities got into this. <laughs> Could you please send us a new one? <laughs> That can be cleaned. <laughs> okay, up next is Bretman Rocks collab with Wet n Wild. The packaging is gorgeous. It's very bright and colorful. This color story is everything to me. Let's get to scraping. Okay, so I really hope Bretman doesn't fight me over this because I see how he pops off on his sister. Oh my God, oh my God. What the <laughs> Princess, what the <laughs> Oh, oh my what God. Did you that one's really soft. My poor favorite one. Oh no, that's actually a good thing because that'll add more of my favorite to the overall. Final row. Oh, oh shoot, I really missed that red one. Shoot, really. Oh, oh, there. oh the black too. What happened to you? What happened? <gasps> it's magnetic. <gasps> Look at it. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so cool. Look at how pretty that is. 
that's looking so awesome. Up next is Lunar Beauty's Greek Goddess palette. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay. If there's a lot of neutrals on this one. There's only one color. Oh, I've really been digging in there. Oh my God. I feel like that can be pushed in. We've only done three. Give this video a thumbs up <laughs> for all this hard work of destroying makeup palettes. It's so hard. <laughs> oh my God. Up next is Hannah Malo's Sugar Rush. Oh, it smells good. It smells like candy. I will say the packaging is awful, but. <laughs> 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 Hannah, I think I'm realizing that this is a face palette and not an eyeshadow, so I'm very sorry, but you seem like a very sweet girl. <gasps> oh! This is a woman after my own damn heart, Kathleen Light. I don't know who you are, but I know that you have great taste in your packaging and your aesthetic. Girl, we are crystal soulmates. You made my dream palette. Oh, wow. Okay, so far this is my favorite palette, not just because of the crystals, but the colors are incredible. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five times. One, two, three, four, five, six, 35? 30. I'm thinking of mathematics. <laughs> okay, listen up, Kathleen. How dare you come for my brand? You know I'm the crystal king. Why couldn't we have collabed on this? Girl, these shades. Mm. Okay, moving on. So we have two more from Miss Kathleen Lights. Girl, I'm not sure how I feel about Dream Street. Sorry. That doesn't make any sense. Spark? I don't think of spark when you dream. You need to have a recall and rename that one. But it's my favorite shade. I just don't think that's the right name. What would you name it? I would name her... You can't go stealing the Oh, sunrise. Oh, sunrise. Sunrise. Okay. Yeah. Good job, Manny. We'll get <laughs> to you in a minute. Okay. Oh my god, I really got a kiki with Kathy because these are everything. I don't really like the Dream Street packaging, but these colors are coming out gorgeous. Up next is the Jaclyn Hill X Morphe Palette Volume 2. So she's already done one in the past. I think this was like four or so years ago, but she came out with a new one very recently. So let's take a look. Ooh, oh, let's just get out of there. Okay, so this is a very, very colorful palette. I actually love this color story very much. Um, I think... <laughs> My favorite <laughs> color. <laughs> I know there was some drama with Jacqueline's Morphe palette, but these colors are so stunning. My only complaint is that my hand is getting tired from how many shades there are here. Goodbye, Jacqueline. Up next is this palette. This is the tackiest palette I've no. seen. Oof, this looks like a little kid's one that you get from Claire's. I don't, like I said, like I don't know much about makeup, but if I were to go and get a palette, this would not be the one I would choose. Sorry to Amrezy and Monica Beverly Hills, but I'm just not living for these shades. But scraping the glitters is so satisfying. You know, it doesn't look as bad anymore. <laughs> I think it actually looks better. <laughs> this is taking so freaking long, you guys. I'm so bored. <laughs> okay, moving on. Up next is Tati Beauty. This is her first palette that she launched. Oh, interesting. Okay, so they're all named the same. So there's different textures, and then she made it so you can go in any order of the columns, and they all go together. You know what? I think that's actually a pretty cool idea. Let's scrape. Ooh, honestly, if you're bored on lockdown, you should scrape some of your old eyeshadow palettes because this feels so nice. Tati came through with these formulas. All right, Tati, you're done. Bye. Moving on. 
Up next is Laura Lee's Nudie Patootie palette. Now, she, I think, was one of the first-ish YouTubers to come out with her own brand. And this was her first palette that she released, but she re-released it this past year. So I figured, why not add this to the bucket? This palette is so classic. I feel like every girl needs this in her makeup collection. This is a great way to just have a girl on the go look. Up next is YouTube's yellow queen, Adeline Morin, with her collab with Tarte. I love, 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 love the packaging on this one. I think it's stunning. She did a great job. Oh, wow. Okay, we have some other stuff in here. I think that's a blush and a highlighter, so we're just gonna stick in this world. There's a lot of nudes. I'm starting to feel like the colors are starting to blend together. I feel like we're gonna end up somewhere in this world in the grand finale. Ooh, that one was so quick. On to the next one! Up next is Shayla X Colourpop. Ooh, simple. Okay, we have another one of those yellows. Ooh, okay. I've seen all these colors so far, but I haven't seen this warning. So I'm gonna say that one is my favorite from these six. Bro. Six shades. Are you joking? It's been a while. It's six, right? Joey. Oh my god, it's oh. nine. Oh my god, something's really wrong with me. I think it's the fumes. What fumes? <laughs> the eyes fumes? Yeah. Maybe that's why all the beauty gurus are fighting. It's because they're all fucking oh, that's true. snorting these eyeshadow fumes. I think that's what it is. We've uncovered <laughs> the bottom. Mm -hmm. Next up is beauty hack legend, RCL Beauty. She came out with her own beauty line this year and she has a very interesting packaging. They're triangles. Haven't seen these so far. I'm actually pretty impressed with how this is. I like the colors, nothing revolutionary. I have actually heard from some of my beauty guru friends. They're like, yeah, her shadows are actually pretty good. So way to go, RCL. I'm triggered. This one, it makes me sick. I don't like it. It really, really <laughs> freaks me out. I'm sorry. Carly Bible. Let's see how it is on the inside. Ooh, okay. I'm liking the shades a lot more than the last one. Anyways, let's get to scraping. Sorry, Carly. I like these shadows, but I can't with this packaging. I literally feel sick looking at this. <sighs> okay, back to some pretty colors. Ooh, okay, I've already actually dove into this palette before. I have a video coming soon of me attempting some drag looks. Ew! You'll understand why there's already been some scrapes here. Honestly, this is me. This is me as a freaking palette. You guys know I love my teal colors. Like, the Jeffree Star palettes really get me excited because I feel like it's it changes up the result of just all these neutrals. All right, let's put this in. Bye, how are ya? <laughs> okay, moving on to the next palette, Manny MUA's Strawberry Dream. Now, I'm gonna state this. I think this is probably the most beautiful packaging that we have seen thus far. Oh, wow. Oh my God, that's beautiful. It's so creamy. That's stunning. Oh my God. Okay, I don't really love this color. It's not my favorite. I love everything else aside from that one. Okay, okay, wow, he really did that. Another Lunar Beauty palette. Makeup Revolution could literally never. Way to go, Manny. I know I said that his, what was it, Strawberry Dream, Dream palette yeah. was my favorite. This is hands down my favorite. Ooh, Sabrina's really pretty. <gasps> oh, that wasn't my fault. That was Manny's fault. go, my witchy sisters. Out of all the Anastasia ones, this is probably the best of the three that we've seen. Still not my favorite, but you know what? It's an upgrade from the Triphobia one. Colors 
pretty good. I actually like big wig. I think that one's my favorite shade. I also like wiggles. Wiggles? <laughs> oh, it's wiggly. I love the names Jackie picked for these shades. I need to learn how to speak Wigglies as well. Gorgeous. Up next is Sister James Charles Morphe palette that he did. So this was also released two years ago, but he re-released it again this year. So let's check it out. Wow, there's some big ones in here. Why is there multiple sizes? Let's get this group. Sister picked some really fun colors. It reminds me of paint you'd get in like kindergarten. Is that why it's called an artistry palette? Put some more, come on, put some more. Don't be shy, put some more. That was a really gentle close. I feel like I need to give it a little more intensity so people don't get mad. Jeez. Next up are Many MUA and Jeffree Star's Morphe collabs, but these just don't feel as rich as their own brands. No shade to these shades. Oh, okay, we finally made it to the end, and that is the Shane Dawson Conspiracy Palette. We also have the Mini Controversy palette, so let's start with the Mini. Ah, it's what? so hard to watch you scrape, and their little icons are so cute. I know, but what can you do? You know, I waited in the Morphe line for hours, and I didn't even get this freaking palette. Can you believe it? I even- Well, enter, I'm doing a good way. <laughs> <laughs> We're down to our last freaking palette! I'm so happy! The Conspiracy Palette. <sighs> I really do like this packaging. I know that they went through a lot to get here. Let's open this bad boy up. Wow. Hey. Uh, oh, this is really gonna hurt me. Do not get mad at me for scraping off these stamps because somewhere Trisha Paytas is hoarding conspiracy palettes like it's toilet paper during a quarantine. Dumperonium, here we go. Okay, well, 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 that was quite the damn adventure. We went through 26 damn palettes to get a sample of each of the shades, and this is what we have. Now, you're probably wondering, Joey, how the heck are you going to mix this all together? Well, I have a product, it's called Fixie. It's a makeup creation and repair kit. Oh my God, you get your own little palette out there. <laughs> that is so cute. So I, I should mix this first. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, wow. Fun. Oh, it's working. So I'm gonna pour it in. <laughs> the next step is to spray it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just for good luck. <laughs> Place the lid over your makeup and press firmly for 10 seconds. Oh, that's it? Wow! That is so cool! Alrighty, you guys, it is time for the grand reveal. This video took me over five hours to make, if you believe it or not. Are you ready? Drum roll! This is the brand new YouTuber palette. Wow! Pretty much exactly what I was expecting, to be honest. It does look really pretty, but you can see like shades of like the rainbow in there. Okay, so we'll do a swatch, a finger swatch first. Oh, okay. She's not very pigmented, which is very weird because this is all pigment. It kind of looks like a bruise. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a little bit of like a, 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 a disease. Okay, let's go in with a brush and see if that makes a difference. Try it on your eye. You're so right. All right, let's get this on the eyeball. Now, I'm not the best at applying makeup, but it's definitely giving me black eye realness. That's actually not bad. That's actually kind of gorgeous, I have to say. Wow. I really don't remember what Sophia's <laughs> look like, but I it probably, probably looks like exactly the same. I got crease and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely some fallout, for sure. Definitely, but it's leaving a nice little <laughs> glitter highlight. Oh, weird, it is leaving like a highlight. Oh, God. Oh, God, <laughs> oh, no. it just keeps spreading. 
Why is it getting worse? She got punched in the face. <laughs> oh my god. Carly Bible punched you in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which one was like the meanest the thing? You, you were probably the meanest thing Hannah Maloge. Hannah Maloge. She did that to me. I'm sorry, Hannah. Okay, now comes the moment you've all been waiting for. The promise I had promised you at the beginning of this video, and that is the makeup giveaway. So, I'm going to be giving away six makeup bundles. I'm gonna be giving away three on my channel and three on my Instagram. So if you wanna check the link down below to my Instagram, you can find out how to win one of the three there. But to enter on my YouTube channel, all you have to do is like this video, be one of my subscribers, and leave a comment down below letting me know what you would name this gorgeous, stunning shade. And also let me know a way that I can get a hold of you. There's probably gonna be people making fake accounts as me to say that you won, so just be careful that you're making sure that I'm talking to you from a verified account. And don't worry, I'm going to clean these up and make them look nice before sending them out. Anyways, I wish you all the best of luck and may the odds be ever in your favor. And until next time, I'll see you.